Well, taking action for parents right now with a really cool summer project that everybody can enjoy, planting a butterfly garden. Tampa Bay Parenting Magazine editor Angela Ardelina was here now to tell us all about it. You've got as some little fuzz seed, right there. As the seed <laughs> pod floats by. I love it. It's nature. <laughs> now, this plant here isn't here just, you know, for looks and beauty. This is actually a perfect plant to attract butterflies. It is. It's a native plant. It's, it's called a penta, and you can get it all kinds of colors, and they grow all year long. They're one of my favorites because they're always blooming and they always look great especially in the hot weather which a lot of our plants can't take but the best part is that butterflies love it it's a nectar plant and they love to eat from your um, pentas so these are the greatest thing that you can put in your yard to feed your butterflies I love it because you know a lot of people may not know that Florida is actually home to a wide range of species of butterflies it is uh, there are so many of them and the best place to start a butterfly garden with your child is to go to Mosey and get some inspiration Mosey has has a butterfly garden that you can walk in, learn all about it, see the different stages. It's awesome. So take your kids there so to kind of get started and then start your own, which is so easy and so fun. The first thing you want to do is get a milkweed, which I plucked this out of my garden today, so he's a little uh, he's a little <laughs> wilty, but um, you probably can recognize it's it is a weed and it has red and yellow flowers and the butterflies love this plant. This is where they lay their eggs. I actually pulled this out of my garden. You can see there's some butterfly eggs That's on awesome. the bottom of the leaf. So nice. They fly in and they lay their eggs right underneath the leaf. It takes, um, I believe, like three days. The eggs hatch and then the tiny little caterpillars are there and then they eat this plant. And the whole plant, they eat the whole plant. Plant comes back. And once they do that, they get big, they chrysalis, they find a nice little place somewhere to go up and, and become a chrysalis. And then in seven, 10 days, you have a butterfly. You know, my girls and I did this and we didn't know anything about it, but we went to a nursery and said, give us some plants that will attract butterflies. Exactly. But the kids learn a whole lot. Tell us, you know, for parents out there who may be thinking, eh, I'm not sure I want to go through this. Well, they kids learn a lot. They do. They see the whole relationship between animals and insects and plants. They get to see an animal go from egg to di the different transformations. It's just so exciting. And not only that, it's beautiful in your yard. So you can look around and see them. These are so easy to grow. They also get, um, they get a bad bug called aphids but aphids attract ladybugs. So this weed is such an awesome weed because it attracts so many different kinds of bugs and kids just love it and it grows like crazy. You can see these are some of the seed pods and this is one of the seed pods that has dried and opened that are the seeds and it just keeps planting themselves. So I don't even have to bother. Once you plant it, once you decide where you're gonna put your butterfly garden, which needs to be a sunny spot, Go ahead and plant it. It'll come back every single year, and you'll have butterflies for years and years. Awesome. Okay. I'll take the seeds. <laughs> Thanks, Angela. As we can let a few more of these go. I love it. We'll plant go. these this weekend. <laughs> well, if you miss any of Angela's points or you want to share her information with another parent, just go to our website, abcactionnews.com. You can also find help with a variety of parenting issues at tampabayparenting.com. And Angela is going to be back with us next week. She'll talk about prodding kids out of procrastination. I can't wait to hear that one. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.